emotional acceptance speech for the sound mixing category by Kevin O'Connell. Yes. This gentleman has been nominated in this category 21 wow. times. 21st time that he was nominated, finally taking home a win. Hence the emotion and the, the sheer joy that you saw from so many people in the audience, right? You know, this guy, everyone kind of jokingly called him the Susan Lucci of the Oscars because he was the one person who had been nominated the most in any category More without, than Meryl. without ever winning <laughs> anything. So when you saw him get up there, I think there was this tremendous release and it was a really sweet yeah. moment. And I'll tell you, you know, who would have thought that the sound categories would be so exciting, but right. it kind of went the opposite way that I thought it would be because basically to explain the difference, sound editing is the sound effects of the movie and then sound mixing is the overall sound of the film. So most people thought that Hacksaw Ridge would win the other one, sound mm -hmm. editing, because it has all those great effects. Right. There's Kevin O'Connell right there. Yep, there I got is. to do an interview with him in front of the Academy, and it was really oh. great for Hacksaw Ridge. On the other hand, sound mixing, the, the safe money was really on La La Land for that, because musicals usually win. Right. So I thought to myself, poor Kevin O'Connell, he's not going to win he, again. We had that conversation, too, and I was like, really? And then he did. So yeah. that, that, was, that was a really Kevin, great well moment. Deserved. And what's interesting there, Andy Wright and Robert McKenzie the other two individuals that were with him for that nomination, yeah. two first-time noms. <laughs> I mean, this poor guy. I mean, Kevin O'Connell has, has been getting Oscar nominations for decades. Yeah, so and there, back in the 90s, he would be nominated every year, sometimes twice in a year. So you have to understand, this has been such a long time coming. Can you imagine getting nominated for 20 Oscars and no, losing them all? I'd be like... I mean, mathematically, you have to win four of them if you get nominated for 20, you would think. So anyway... Sound really editing, though, we, uh, we also that was arrival, arrival to come that. And then we got to make mention to uh, oh, the really saying. nice... Uh, rain shower that they received in the theater of candy. Who can watch a movie without candy, right? Hello. Where's our candy? Well, we've got Oreos. That's not a bad thing. Oh yeah, egg. that's true. We got we do have pretty good. Yeah, so that, that's <laughs> not bad. But that was that was really great. A really fun a really fun idea. Yeah. And kind it's of a long like show. And there's no food people at get the hungry. Oscars. You have they to do. wait till the governor's ball to eat anything. So these people and they haven't eaten all day. So all these people at the Oscars are hungry and they've done the red carpet, they've sucked it all in, so now they can actually sit now and let it out yeah. and, and eat something. So that that was really good.